Hey y'all, it's me Candace the Aries, back with another one. Let's talk about black on black crime. Okay, I'm gonna make this quick, I promise. Um, again, I've been seeing a lot of Facebook posts about people talking about, um, oh man, you know, if black people were as passionate about white people killing black people as they were with black people killing black people, this world would be a better place. What I find funny is the fact that there is no other race that has a name for when they kill their own race. Black people are the only ones. Black people are the only race that has black on black crime. There's no white on white crime. There's no other kind of no other race against no other race crime. I wonder why that is. So, yeah, black people kill black people. But white people kill white people too. Hispanic people kill Hispanic people. German people kill German people. And so on and so forth. Every race kills their own race. Every race does. But statistically speaking... There's one race who's been killing since forever. And I'll tell you who they don't look like. And I'll tell you what letter it doesn't, their name, their race doesn't start with. And that would be a B. So y'all really need to stop with this black on black crime stuff because it's getting weak. It's getting sad. And I see more black people using black on black crime than any other race. And that is sickening in itself. There is no such thing as black on black crime. It's crime. It's crime. Black people killing black people just like white people kill white people. White kid go in and shoot up the whole school. Kill a bunch of white kids and teachers and staff. Nobody reports it as white on white crime. White man don't want to divorce his wife, kills his whole family. This has happened so many times. I, I don't lost count. Nobody calls that white on white crime. Nobody says, oh, well, you know what? All of these white kids coming to school with their parents' guns that's not locked away, that's supposed to be locked away, and they're shooting up the whole school and killing everybody in the school. Maybe we should put metal detectors in a school to make the school a better place. Maybe we should have them with clear backpacks so we can see what's in their backpacks so that they're not a threat. Maybe we should have security on deck so that we should we can make sure that they're not put, bringing any weapons into the school when they're going through these metal detectors. Now, they only got that in black schools. They only have that in minority schools where they feel the most threatened by minorities. But y'all don't have that in the white schools where it needs to be because the only people that are, that are shooting up schools are white people. That's it. Black people have guns legally. Just like white people have guns legally. Black kids don't shoot up schools. Black people don't shoot up schools. Minorities don't shoot up schools. And if they do, that's news to me. And it's still not as much as white people shoot up schools. White people have been shooting up schools for the longest. This is the longest stint that they've gone without shooting up a school. And that's only because they can't go to school. So, yeah. The black on black crime shit is weak. And I'm sick of it. And black people, y'all need to do better and stop saying it and stop playing into the propaganda. Because every race kills their own race. If you put a magnifying glass on one race, of course it's going to seem like they're killing. They're doing the most killings because that's the only race that you're looking at. But you're not looking at the rest of the white people in the room. There's a rest of the guy who killed two people. I'm not going to do this with y'all. I'm just not. So, that's it you guys. So, um, yeah. If you guys like this video or you just like my vibe, make sure you go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. And until the next time we meet, be the change that you want to see.